What the fuck? Do you remember when prank videos were just people doing weird, harmless shit in public? Or prank calls? Do you miss those times? If so, you're fucking stupid, friend. Pranks are now EXTREME! If your prank isn't gone wrong, gone sexual, extreme, gone wild, or backfired, your content is shit. Yes, indeed, ladies and gentlemen, we are at a point in time where anybody can take advantage of YouTube's algorithms, make a clickbait title, at a clickbait thumbnail with the concept that sounds somewhat interesting to people who don't yet know how cancerous the content really is and rake in views guaranteed. You don't even have to have any meat to the video. Just grab your girlfriend, get a kitten for the thumbnail, and title the video Killing Girlfriend's Kitten Prank and watch the views come pouring in. Wait, Killing Girlfriend's Kitten Prank? That doesn't sound right, does it? Well, it does if you're a fan of Robin Burrell. FUCK! Robin isn't actually Robin at all. Robin is a boyfriend versus girlfriend prank channel in the vein of BF versus GF. And before we even begin, I want to make it clear so we're all on the same page. This shit is obviously fake. I mean, come on. How can you have a YouTube channel based on pranking each other and still fall for each other's pranks all the time? Now, I'm not saying there's anything inherently wrong with faking pranks. The problem is when you actively mislead people into believing those pranks are real. Now, let me give you an idea of what kind of content we're dealing with here. Drug prank prank on mom, porn prank on mom, sex with girlfriend's mom prank, cheating prank, STD cheating prank on girlfriend, mouse trap on balls prank, waxing prank on sleeping boyfriend. He looks pretty fucking awake to me by the way, and it goes on and on and on. We're going to be taking a look at some of the more entertaining ones, I guess. Okay, so Emma's at work right now teaching swimming and when she comes home in a couple of hours I'm going to be hiding and waiting for the perfect opportunity <laughs> to give her the fright of her life. I'm sorry Emma and I re I'm really hoping I don't give her a heart attack because this costume is pretty scary. So let's show you guys the costume now. Shit dude, I don't know if I'm ready for this. I don't know if I can handle this shit right now dude. This is a fuck. Alright, let's take a look at this. Let's see how scary this costume is. So let's show you guys the costume now. Whoa! Holy shit. Okay. That was so so, this is the clown costume. As you can see, I still need to put some makeup down here and I'm gonna be painting my hands white <laughs> to make it really scary. Once again, folks, this is gonna be very spooky and scary. This is not for the faint of heart. And with that said, let's see the prank. I bet he's gonna get her good. Hey, it's the classic trick where you exploit your girlfriend's body for views. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Emma. It's me. You're okay. It's me, it's me, it's me, it's me. I'm joking. <laughs> Got it! Got it! What a reaction. That face tells me that even she thinks this is an awful prank. And this is her most successful video. This video's gotten over 11 million views in a week based on the thumbnail and title alone. Not to mention the retarded clown shit that's been going on recently. Fantastic. Yo guys, welcome back to a brand new video. So today I've got a crazy prank for you. My brother thought it'd be funny to put four mousetraps on the side of my bed. Oh, your brother Jamie, who makes prank videos for our foreign brethren. Yo Leute, herzlich willkommen zu einem weiteren Prank mal endlich wieder. Sorry, dass ich so lange nichts mehr hochgeladen habe, aber jetzt geht's richtig los. Mein Bruder ist wieder hier. And he was stupid enough to leave the mousetraps in my room. I mean, Jamie, come on, how can you be so stupid to leave the mousetraps in my room? Do you not know that I'm going to prank you back? Just to give you a quick demonstration of how powerful this is, you're going to have to pretend that this is Jamie's balls and this is the mousetrap. Oh! Shit, I'm not going to lie, this might be the first time I've hoped a prank is fake. I mean, that shit's fucked up, man. Also, why are you talking about your brother's balls? Pretend this is Jamie's balls. You see right there, that is strong. That is designed to break a mouse's spine. And today we're going to be breaking Jamie's ball sack. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? 
Okay, if he doesn't get knocked out, this shit is fake. I'll call it out right now. This shit is fake if he doesn't get socked in the fucking mouth. Honestly, I think this might be real. If it is, I'm just happy this cunt isn't my brother. What a fucking asshole. Oh! Ah! That's it? That's all he does in response to the mouse trap on his balls? I would have this motherfucker's head on a stick. There is no way somebody puts a mouse trap on my dick and gets away with it. So my brother thought it would be funny to put a fucking mouse trap on my balls, so um I was thinking what I could do to get my revenge and I had a really good idea that I can just take two mouse traps and just put them on his balls when he's asleep. Let's go. Well shit, I guess that's more satisfying than punching him. <laughs> I don't feel bad for him either. I wonder how he's gonna get that mouse trap on his brother's vagina though. <laughs> Do you see that face? That's the face of a man with nothing left to live for. <laughs> you motherfucking guy, you bitch! Jesus fucking Christ. As far as pranks go, that was one of the hardest to watch. Not because I'm grossed out by dicks or anything, but because destroying your own reproductive organs for YouTube views is pretty fucked up. Anyways guys, if you enjoyed this video, let me know down below by subscribing and leaving a like. If you didn't like the video, fuck off you dickhead. You can call me a leafy clone in the comments. I may end up making another video on these guys because honestly there's something to say about almost all of their videos. That's about it, so thanks for watching. I'll be seeing ya. Peace.